You know what's great? Pizza's great. Unless it's Papa John's. F that place. You know what's also great? The male person. The male person's great. I'm getting a little bit off track. Anyways, the great male person dropped off a great flyer in my mail today for Pizza Pizza's Superfood Pizza. Did Pizza Pizza ruin pizza? Or did they make it even more great? Well, I, Kyle Harrington, am going to find out. So for breakfast, I guess I'm gonna be eating the superfood pizza. Maybe it is a healthy breakfast. Let's find out. I don't know how this is gonna taste, but I mean, it looks kind of good. Purple part kind of looks a little questionable, but give them a call. Superfood pizza crust. I don't even know how to properly order this. I have some weird feeling that I'm gonna be the first person to ever order this pizza. Thank you for calling Pizza Pizza. Is that some mesh target phone number, please? Sorry? May I have your phone number? Uh, 519. I'm not sure if this is a just a pizza or the crust, but I got an ad. It's for the superfood crust pizza. Now, I'm not sure if there's just like a... Sorry? What topping? Is, is there like a pre-made just like healthy pizza with the superfood crust pizza? Like is there like a... a... Yeah, yeah, it's up to you what, uh, what, what topping you want. It's up to you. Oh, okay. Well, I'm kind of just looking at this picture in the ad. Um, There's no like preset standard one that you can just give me, right? So that's just the crust. Yeah, exactly. And then how many toppings do you get with that? Zero for twelve ninety nine. The cheese, the cheese on it is just a regular cheese. Yeah, regular mozzarella cheese. Okay. Do you have a like a, a a vegan or like a healthier cheese option? Cheese option we have uh, like feta cheese, goat cheese, parmesan cheese. Okay. Uh, you don't have any. Okay. So there's no like uh, fake cheese one, like vegan cheese, or did you say that? Yeah, it's uh, feta cheese, goat cheese, parmesan cheese, cheese base, base free cheese base. Sorry. Uh, what was that last one? Four cheese base. So there's no there's no vegan cheese, right? No? Okay. Hey, Scott, what do you think the healthiest cheese is? Sorry, I'm just trying to make a healthy pizza right now. And uh, I, I thought the, the superfood pizza was just like a pre-made thing, but I didn't realize it was just the crust. Uh, you want to add in topping or not? Sure. Let's have some spinach, banana peppers, onion. For the cheese, let's just go with... Uh, if, if, what would you say the healthiest cheese is? <laughs> no. Uh, you you want to cheese, extra cheese? You're talking about extra cheese? No, no, no. Like, no, like, a, like, like what's, what's a nice like low-calorie cheese? Do you know? Yeah, we have a uh, dish. Okay, let's just go with the regular base that comes with it then. It's twenty dollars and forty four cents and you order ready for pickup within fifteen to twenty minutes. Perfect. All right, take care. Bye. I'm going bankrupt. So what did we learn? Always order your pizza online. That was so, so difficult. Anyways, I guess we wait 15 to 20 minutes and then go spend my life savings on this effing pizza, dude. Okay, time to go get our overpriced, bullshit, delicious, hopefully superfood, healthy pizza for breakfast. So I just got the pizza pizza and I forgot my wallet at home. So, okay, back home we go. Where's my wallet? Where's my wallet? Have a good one. Okay guys, I can't believe I just spent $20 on a medium pizza. This thing better be so freaking healthy, dude. I better grow like 20 feet after I eat this. Oh, here we go. Wow. That doesn't look purple like in the photo. Okay, the crust doesn't look as disgusting as it does in the photo to be honest. It looks, look at the crust in the photo. Like it looks so weird in the photo, but on an actual pizza, it looks pretty good. Okay, I guess it's like pretty purple looking, but you can see on the side a little bit here. So this crust right here is made from purple cauliflower, purple sweet potato, and butternut squash. It's vegan, gluten-free, and contains no artificial flavors or colors. So it's all natural color, and I guess let's dive in. It's pretty good. It kinda just tastes like a thin crust pizza to me. I'm surprisingly impressed with this. 20 bucks, which is a little pricey, but without the three extra toppings, it's only $13, which is still more expensive than like a regular medium pizza, I guess, but I would definitely recommend trying this out if you're looking for a healthier option with pizza, because yeah, that's good. Don't forget to like this video because I spent my very last $20 and I need all the help I can get and it really helps with the YouTube algorithm. Also, comment your favorite pizza spot or something. I don't know. We're going to get Scott for his second opinion on the purple super crust. It's uh, just as purple as you'd expect. That doesn't look purple like in the photo. That's so funny. I said the exact opposite. I mean, that's pretty purple. Like, yeah, kind of just like a sponge. Okay, this review is over. The U.S. threw up a steel fence prepared to stop any vessel carrying materials aboard.